If you're old enough to do your taxes, you're old enough to have some wine. <sighs> bon appetit. Oh, where are my manners? Would you like some cherry tomatoes? Let's see if I can get these open. Oh, these are the kind that you don't have to wash. There you go. A little tomato. One or two. Tomatoes are very, very relaxing, actually. They have a lot of relaxing oxidants in them. That's what I've heard. So, oh, plastic only. Yeah, not in since last week. Um, you're looking to do your taxes, right? Okay. Let me think. Right, I need your name. I need a lot of information from you, actually. So let me get out my briefcase here. to take your picture. Mm -hmm. Well, we have to send a picture with your taxes. That way they know who it's from. This is your first time. So we'll be taking that photograph. Now I'm going to just want to use the first pencil. Okay, that's fine. I'll have a little of the pencil filler. Just grab a little or two of those. Oh, well they feel nice. Good. 
not close up anyway. It's fine. Sometimes sevens look like fours to me, but that's it. No worries. Okay. I don't have any forms or anything because that's not relaxing. Oh no, this pencil's not working. I'm gonna have to get my briefcase out again. There we go. Forms aren't relaxing, so you just go ahead and you give me whatever information you'd like. Like, what's your name, honey? I see. And your last name, of course. you have the middle name? Hmm. Oh no, nothing. I just was married to someone with that name once. Once. Not twice. Once. Okay. Next, how many taxes do you owe? Okay. That's fine. Where do you live? Now, is that a gated community? Do you use deadbolts? Okay. Wonderful. Does anybody have an extra key to your home? Your neighbor. And what's their name? Okay. Their occupation? Okay, so they probably not do home too much during the day. Okay. No problem want to make sure I'm getting you the lowest possible rate. Now, have you lived here the whole year? Good, that means you only have to pay one tax. I pay tax every day. Mm -hmm. When I get my morning bagel, when I get my morning smoothie, when I get my morning milkshake, then when I get my morning pancakes, and then when I get my afternoon snack, when I get my afternoon sandwich, when I do my afternoon shopping, I'll have to pay tax every single time it's on the receipt. So I don't have to pay taxes this year. I already do and I pay them every day. But you, no, you're gonna owe a little bit of money, aren't you? That's okay. That's alright. So, Mm, do you know what bracket you're in? That's a bracket. I'll show you. This is a bracket. So you're somewhere in here. Perfect. Okay. So... Are you going to put any money away for your retirement? You look quite young, so I wouldn't be dreaming about retirement just yet, <laughs> okay? That's alright. We have five dollars a year. By the time you retire, you will be dead. Okay, next we have to... Some things. Now, are you married? Okay, do you have any children? Okay, and do you have any pets? I think I can get you a little break for that. I met someone with piranhas. You didn't know any taxes. Okay. Do you work full-time job? Okay, you're self-employed. You're gonna have a bad time. <laughs> oh, gonna have a bad time indeed. Okay, so. Get that pencil. Oh, I see here. How much do you want to pay in taxes this year? 
And how much would you like the government to give back to you? Okay. I think I can make that happen. I really do. All we have to do is send them a nice letter, give them some money, and they'll give you money back depending on how much of an asset you are to the country. Like me. <laughs> oh, I am. I am rewarded handsomely. See? This is relaxing. Sorry, I had a little something on your face there. Okay, so. I have your name. I have your address. I have your occupation. Oh, I have your neighbor's occupation. What is yours? You said you work. Okay. And you haven't moved. We have your marital status. Children. Pets. How much you want to pay the government. And how much you'd like to receive back from them. Because after all, you are a beautiful contribution to society and therefore should be enticed to stay in the country. Exactly. Okay. When I'm doing my taxes, a little bit of my southern side comes out. That's true. Okay. <clears throat> well, you get a little bit of a tax break if you got an accent. It's true. Do you have an accent? The correct answer is yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Next up, we should have you write the government your tax letter. I have a couple options here for you. And since we are a luxury tax office, we have beautiful letters for you to pick from. Okay, this one's a birthday card. It's cute though. It's got puppies on it. We got it's a pretty little lady right here. Nice striped stockings. This one's got some lavender flowers on it. I hope that if I told you, it would come as no surprise that a friend like you means more to me than you could ever. Elias is spelled with an S. Oh no. Oh no. The United States government would not like that at all. Can't use that. Oh. <clears throat> May all the seeds of kindness that you've spread along the way return to you and multiply on this, your special tax day. Happy birthday. Okay, we're just gonna my other briefcase. I think we should use this card. Where my other briefcase go? Oh dear. Um. I'm not sure. I'm going to have to use pencil. Oh, I'll have you use my special pen. Now this right here is uh, my medical pen that I got back when I was a surgeon. Oh yeah, just left for <laughs> creative reasons and differences. Okay. Oh, between me and the super. Okay, here we go. Happy birthday. Happy. Tax day. Oh dear. I suppose it's been quite, quite a few years since I've been working as a surgeon. We're gonna have to use our pencil. Happy.
had a couple more clients before you came in. I'm very relaxed. Now this is from you. And you're gonna give them... Okay. I think $20 should be fine. And you're asking in return... $2,000. Okay. I don't see why they would not acquiesce to that request. Considering you're sending them a very professional card. You are an absolute joy to society. And... You have many talents that should not be taxed. In fact, it is unconstitutional for you to have to pay more than this. I'm going to write that in. I found that whenever I'm in a little bit of trouble, if you tell someone that, what they're doing is unconstitutional. They usually get a little nervous and will pretty much just do what you were asking. So we're just going to write that in. Now, I'm going to need you to sign this. Thank you for letting me hold your hand while you sign that. And now... in here. Seal that up. What I think you should do is I think that you should get the envelope a little kiss. I'm going to write the U.S. government And you see it right there. The US government. It's run by the people. What we want. Okay. I don't know why everyone says that taxes are stressful. It's really not so bad. Exactly. I saw a gap in the market. Nobody was offering relax in taxes. But you're having a good time, aren't you? I knew it. The U.S. government. And it's going to be from Relax and Texas. And do you have a stamp? I don't really have a stamp. I have a Sims 2. And a DVD of Talladega Nights. Okay, well, we're just gonna let the government cover it. No postage needed. That's all you have to do. Okay, so you go ahead and you give this envelope a little kiss. Lovely. And now it's time for me to just put a little bit of powder on your face. It comes with this little fancy brush here. Look at that. Whoa. <laughs> no brush. Oh, there's a brush. No brush. Oh, one right there. No. There it is. Okay. So. Make it a little less shiny. Okay. We like matte tax givers here. <laughs> Alright. Now I'm going to take your picture. Don't be afraid. One, two, three. And 
to the side. One, two, three. Okay. Now I'm going to send this. I'm just going to text it to the text person. Well, that's what I have them in my phone at. The text person. And I'm going to let them know that your taxes will be on their way nice and early. Nice and official. And that'll be five hundred dollars. Oh, that's okay. Um, I do have Venmo. I have PayPal and uh, credit card, cash, layaway. No problem. Once you get that two thousand dollars from the government, you'll be able to pay me right back. Okay. Okay, but if you don't, I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to come and get it. Um, but no rush. A little bit of a rush, but it's fine. Okay. Well, are you sufficiently relaxing after your taxes? An easy process, but one made easier by your good friend Daisy. Well, you come back on around any time you want. We can do next year's taxes, year after that taxes, do them all in advance. Mm hmm. Seven days a week, baby. All right. Now you go on. You go on to shoot. Bye bye.